Martingale roulette strategy is dangerous and should be avoided. What is the Martingale strategy? It consists to play one roulette color, the red, or the black, and to double the initial betting on the same color in case of loss. While some guys pretends having a strategy to win at the casino's roulette with the Martingale strategy, I advise you not to try such strategy as you will probably win lots of small payout, but when losing if a series of red or black color occur, you'll remember it and never play the Martingale again. So what is this supposed strategy, which in fact is a dangerous one? It consists to bet as example $5 on the red or black color, let's choose the red, you bet $5 on it. If the ball hit a red number you win $5, plus your $5 initial bet, but if the ball hit the black number, in this case you lose your bet, the martingale strategy consists to double your bet on the same color until the ball hit your color. So you play $5 on the red, if the ball hit the black, play $10 again on the red, if you lose, double up to $20, and if you still losing, carry on the double, $40, $80. $160 and so on. Until the roulette ball hit your betting color, currently the red, and then you will win $5. Some can say, wow it is a good strategy, you just double your bet on your selected color until you win. Ok, but think, what will happen if the opposite color, currently the black, is hit by the roulette ball for 10, 20 or more times, this is happening not every time, but regularly on the roulette game and then you will hit the roulette table betting limit, and lose a lot, let's calcul, as example with a $3000 betting limit imposed by the casino. If the same color is hit 10 times, your bet is $5 plus $10 plus $20 plus $40 plus $80 plus $160 plus $320 plus $640 plus $1280 plus $2560 equals total bet. $5,115, so you just lose $5,115 for a game where you can win $5 on each ball game, even if you win 100 times $5, so you've won $500, but on 100 winning games, but then think that you can lose $5,115 in one game, and if you want to try to win this money back, how many winning games you have to get? Too much. So just think how the martingale strategy can be dangerous to play with, and it is not recommended at all. Example A player bet $5 on the black, if the roulette ball hit the black color, the player win $5, plus his $5 initial betting, so he get a total of $10. If the roulette ball hit the red color, the player lose his $5 bet, then, he just double his betting, from $5 to $10, if the player lose again, he double from $10 to $20, and still doubling in case of loss, to $40, 80, 160, 320, 640, 1280, 2560 and so on, doubling unto winning. Then it's supposed to be a winning strategy when playing roulette, and some peoples can think that this is a clever strategy. But it is not. As it can be dangerous for the player as he can lose a considerable amount of bettings if playing this martingale roulette strategy. Why? Just ask yourself a question, what will happen, as on this example on which the player bet on the black color, if there's a series of red colors, such as 20 red, which can happen on roulette game. The player will lose lots of betting. Let's figure it out on a table. The player bet is $5 on a color with a maximum betting limit of $6,000 allowed by the casino on this example, but still losing for 11 consecutive games. The bet loss is $5, plus $10, plus 20, plus 40, plus 80, plus 160, plus 320, plus 640, plus 1280, plus 2560, plus $5,120. And at this time, the player cannot double the $5,120 betting as the maximum bet allowed by the casino is reached. Ending up to a total loss of $10,235. And this was just a martingale roulette game strategy to win $5 on each winning, but ended up with a $10,235 loss. Now let's figure out another table with $1 initial betting. 
player double his initial betting of $1 for every loss, Martingale strategy, player plays the black color, but there is a series of red color, currently 13 red hits. Now analyze this table. The player is playing $1 as initial bet, as example on the red color, and he has doubled 13 times its initial betting due to betting loss. As example if there is a series of red color, for a total of 13 roulette spin game, so the total betting loss for the player is $8,191. And this quiet big loss was played on a strategy for winning $1 by $1. A small winning amount if we consider the loss potential risk. On this example I have selected a roulette table with a maximum betting of $6,000 on colors, so on this table shown. The player cannot double from 4096 to 8192, as the maximum bet allowed by the casino is reached. The player just lost $8,191. And to get this amount back by playing the Martingale Roulette strategy at $1, the player will need to win lots of games at $1 each. Taking then another big risk of getting again such big losses, like the $8,191 show on this example. Of course, it is rare on roulette to hit the same color for a series of 10 or 20 times, but this is happening sometimes on roulette game. And when playing with the martingale strategy, this can be dangerous as when losing, the loss is quite high. Look at these example of roulette colors hit, on the left example you can see a series of red color with just one black color. But what if? This single black color hit was a red color. It will then be a series of 13 numbers from the same color, currently the red. And playing the martingale strategy can be then dangerous, as the bet's loss will be too high compared to the possible winning of low bets. It is rare, but it happens regularly to see a series of the same color on roulette game. I have seen many times the same color being hit like, 10, 20 times or more. And according to this, it is better to play a simple flat betting than the martingale strategy on roulette game. Now let's compare martingale versus flat betting. These two tables are showing the difference between the martingale and the flat betting strategy in case of loss due to consecutive losing games. On the martingale strategy, for 11 roulette ball spin game, player has lost 11 times and the total loss is $5,120. For 15 roulette ball spin game, player has lost 15 times. And the total loss is $75. Important note, your odds when playing red or black colors on European roulette, single zero, are 48.6% when playing red or black. And not 50% like many peoples are thinking, don't forget the zero, zero is not a black or red color number, but green. There is one zero on the European roulette and the zero plus the double zero on the American roulette with odds at 47.37%. A player playing roulette colors such as red or black has more chances to get winning spins on the European roulette with one zero. Than on the American roulette with a zero and double zero. For an even money betting, let's say red and black, players win if the ball spin stops on any of the 18 numbers that has that color. That makes your chances of winning from 18 to 37 on the European roulette, with odds of 48.6%. And 18 to 38 on the American roulette, with odds of 47.37%. Calculating the casino house edge for a bet that pays out even money is simple, as example for the American roulette, with odds at 47.37% for the player. And 52.63% for the casino. This makes the following calculation. 47.37 minus 52.63 equal 5.26%. Let's see an example of playing the Martingale Roulette strategy on an online casino. I have recorded it on video to show you. I started with a $20.000 cash credits by playing $5 as initial bet on the Martingale strategy. And I reached $20.450 cash credits. So in this example, I have won $450 in few minutes. Seems easy? But wait. 
how much I will lose if a roulette ball spin into the same color for a series of, as example 11 spins. I will lose $5,120. This video example is to show you that this martingale strategy can seems to be attractive, as easy to get winnings on a roulette, but it is not. Remember. How much I will lose if a same series of color get hit by the spinning ball for more than 10 times? A lot. So myself as an ex-casino employee, I will rather play with the flat betting strategy than the martingale. I am starting to play the martingale roulette strategy with a current cash balance of $20,000, and on this video, I will end up with a $20,450 as cash balance in just few minutes. But I am advising you that in this current game, I was lucky to not get a series of same color hit by the spinning ball. Because if this was happening, I will lose a lot. So this example is to show you that the martingale seems easy as a winning strategy for the roulette game. But it is not. Remember the loss shown on tables previously on the martingale strategy if the same color is hit by the spinning ball for more 1 or 20 times. The loss will be too high.